out because he's he's good at like just starting combos up, and once you start getting combos, he has great reads, so it's just all bad. But anyway, uh, zero, zero from a. Uh, Zero's from Vegas and Frost is from Utah as well? He's Utah. He, Frost actually knocked me into losers. Okay. So I think that's where he's coming from. But it might be, uh, this is probably round three winners. Okay, yep. Um, and uh, Zero is our... It's, it's Vegas power ranking, I don't know, it's, it's tough. It's like, it goes, oh, he's, he's hands down number one. Right. And then uh, two and three, it's a debate between Lycan and... Uh, probably Lycan and Zed. And, Fourth is probably Hino, and then fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. It's like a toss-up between like me, uh, Zero, Dan's the man. Dan's the man, yeah. Oh, come on, Zero. What are the other strong regions for uh, for Smash Four? I mean, uh, obviously, SoCal. Okay, yeah. Um, probably some regions, definitely regions in the East Coast. Okay, okay. But Vegas is definitely like top five region right now. Uh, uh I, I, I can't really say that. I mean, well, we, we definitely do have Poe. And uh, Poe, I mean, Poe's been placing great at our um, at our monthlies that we have. With, right. With, uh, with zero, Chile zero. Yeah. With, in attendance. And uh, Poe's been placing like second and third. Right. But I mean, to consider us as a top five region, I, I really can't say that uh -huh. until we actually play the other regions. We just basically been playing SoCal. <laughs> that's all. Yeah, and then, I don't know, Evo would solidify like... Okay, yeah, definitely. That's that's going to be the big... So that's going to be huge for Smash 4. Like, definitely. So it's going to definitely <laughs> show what the future of this game is. But uh, I like how Zero, um, he uh, reps, or he reps his character with whatever shirt he's wearing. I know that when I when I go to uh, uh, PSG in Vegas and like see him play PM, he's always wearing his like Olimar shirt. Yeah. And then yeah. so now he's wearing a Rosalina and Luna shirt. So yeah. He, he's been ready for this. He's my he's my partner in a PM. Oh, there you go. Yeah, he's he's great in teams. You guys run Falco Olimar? Falco Olimar. Um, Feeling pretty confident. Uh, we were able to beat. We beat West Balls and Reno. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah when they were there for uh, at a sh shuffle. Shuffle, yeah. I was there. That was a lot of fun. That was. This, that was a this game could go either either way right now. Yeah, I mean. The cost is currently ranked number five in the top. Okay, and zero. That's the man. Get the Zero's around there too. Like our five to eight is hard to say. Like it's a toss up. It's like me zero. Kinzer and uh, Dan the man. So this is winner's final with the pool. With the oh, pool. the footstool. Oh. So the winner's yeah. is guaranteed to go into bracket. Yep. On winner's side, yeah. yeah. Very important to go in on winner's side. Yeah. Going in on loser's side, that's going to be tough. Yeah. It's going to be hurting. All the, all the eight players that make it out, they're all skilled. <laughs> oh. Yeah, Frost is pretty good, man. He, he's giving me a whooping. Zero suit. I have a hard time against Zero suit. Hey, Frost. I've never, I never played a Zero suit once. Really? You never got messed up with him in bracket or anything? Nope, but I believe Fox can jab, tap, jab, a jab block for a Zero suit really bad because Zero suit has a really bad neutral. Yeah. Yeah, she, I mean, she, she's got so much end lag on her crab, mm -hmm. and that's what she wants to like all the time. I don't know, she's kind of like a flow charty character. Like, yeah. It seems like, it's like, okay, I'm at range, oh, I'm going to neutral be you, or shoot at, or I'm going to shoot at you, um, you know, and just like dash attack, grab afterwards, and, I don't know. I mean, a lot of characters in the game are kind of like that, but... Yeah. <laughs> Let's be honest, but. Oh, Lycan, uh, he mains, he mains Ness, and he also uses Diddy Kong. He used to main Ness, I mean, he used to main Diddy Kong, and then Diddy Kong got nerfed, and he started, like, losing, and then he switched to Ness, and he's still doing well. But he's probably our, well, I would say he's about rank three in Vegas. Yeah, I think I was at this last week, and, uh, that Lycan is uh, ranked higher than Falco, uh, for sure. Uh, 
Not currently. Actually, Kvothe, actually, he's always been ranked higher. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, he was supposed to go to Japan with, like, MGK and stuff. Yeah. And, then, like, had some passport problems or whatever. But that would be cool to see them, like, see them play against a Japanese player. Japanese players outside of, like, Apex. Definitely. He might even get a uh, top eight at Evo if, uh, mm -hmm. if Japan uh, can't step it up. That'd be cool to see too. I learned in this game, you know, it's, it's always best to play patient. Yeah. I feel like I feel like rolling in this game. Sometimes it's so hard to punish rolls. And I got a match. Yeah. I'll be right back. Okay, good luck, man. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just to get uh, just to get going on what Kyle was saying, yeah, rolls can be, uh, I guess, lack of a better word, kind of problematic for some people to adjust to. But that was a pretty quick game. Uh, tied up one to one. Yeah. So because rolling has uh, a lot of the end that can move. Yeah. And so it's not as punishable as in previous situations. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, I don't know. It seems like the game feels pretty slippery in a sense, but the floors have different traction if you played on anything with grass stages, you know? Uh, if, you, if you like counter pick uh, an Omega stage with grass on it, you know, you can definitely feel the difference in traction in that. Shout out to Tuesday! Shout out to Tuesday! Oh, Tuesday. He's in uh, Texas right now, right? I think that's, um, that's where he's at. Mm -hmm. He was like one of the top players when I started like playing Smash and like I first traveled to New York. And he taught me how to like play Sheik. I don't know if you remember that, but I don't play Sheik anymore. <laughs> no, that's cool. Uh, what do you think about FD? As a, uh, as a counterfeit for Zero Suit. Um, I think it's actually good because the platforms won't mess up her combo game. I think they always like. I think they always make her combo game better though. You can, Do they? Probably, because I feel like you can just chase with your up B and get an early kill. If yeah. you uh, if you can like refresh your jumps because you're just landing a little bit higher and higher and higher from the platforms, you know. But I don't know. That's just me. That's just what I kind of do. But I don't know. I'm not. I'm not a fan of these guys. So. I mean, it looks like the customs that Zero is using really favors like FD as well, when he can just put on he can put on some good projectile pressure from that range. It looks like Luma's on Zyper. Yeah. yeah. So let's see if he can make something go on without Luma. Yeah. Oh. There it is. Yep. Probably just gonna die off the side, but guess not. Yeah. So it's still pretty close, but um, it's hard to SDI out of the. Well, it's hard to SDI anything, but right. <laughs> it's hard to... It's considerably weaker. Yeah, it's hard to DI out of the upbeat of Zero Suit, no matter, like, how, how many hits it is. Like, it's, it's tough. So, um, yeah, I don't know if, like, it's at higher percentage you can escape it, or you need to get lucky, or... I don't even know, but, you know, Zero Suit is a pretty solid character when it comes to aerial kill options. Excuse the bias, but let's go, Frost. Um, hey Tim. Hey Tim. Right, we're doing best of three, best of five. All right. All right. Good showing from both Zero and Frost. Yeah, that was pretty back and forth. So yeah. Uh, that last game it looked like uh, Frost was. Uh, making the best of when Lumu was down and being yeah. a little bit more aggressive and got that final kill while Lumu was barely coming back. So. 